Hey guys, in this video I'll show you how to connect Eero to Verizon 5G home internet. Now, to connect an Eero mesh system to your Verizon 5G home internet, you'll need to plug in your Eero gateway to an available Ethernet port on the Verizon 5G gateway and then set up the Eero device as a bridge. So I'm going to show you a more detailed breakdown for this, right? So this is how you set up the Eero gateway. So we talked about this already. So you just need to go ahead and plug in the Eero gateway and just plug, you know, the Eero gateway into a power outlet and connect it to the Verizon gateway. And what you can do is you can use an Ethernet cable to connect the Eero gateway to an available Ethernet port on the Verizon 5G gateway. And then just follow the Eero setup, right? Download the Eero app and follow the on-screen instructions to set up your Eero network. Set Eero to bridge mode. And once the Eero network is set up, go to the Eero app and set the Eero gateway to bridge mode. And what you can do, guys, is you can add additional nodes if it is applicable, right? Just plug in the additional Eero nodes and follow the on-screen instructions. Make sure you place them strategically, right, in locations where you want to improve your Wi-Fi coverage. If you're having trouble, just check the Ethernet connection. Ensure that all the Ethernet cables are securely plugged in to both the Euro gateway and the Verizon 5G gateway. Restart your devices if you encounter any issues. And of course, you can always contact support for further assistance. It's really that easy and simple. So I hope this guide provided value to you. And if it did, consider smashing the like button as well as subscribing to Frequently Asked Questions. And I'll see you in the next one.